this is her favorite hunting spot. A dried up river in the heart of her territory. It runs through a clearing full of puku and impala. Down in the gully, she's hidden from view, even in broad daylight. She'll only strike when prey come close to the gully's edge. While she watches and waits, the hunter becomes the hunted. A lioness from the Ensefu pride is on her trail. Kamuti is unaware of the danger she's in. The lioness's gait intensifies. Her top speed is 36 miles an hour. Almost as fast as Kamuti's. The lioness stands guard, confident she has Kamuti trapped. But Kamuti is wily and sneaks off unnoticed. Once again, she must hide until darkness returns. The baboons are settling down for the night. Time for some grooming. This is as much about strengthening bonds as it is about removing parasites. And strong bonds are all the more vital when predators are about. Other hunters are on the prowl. A crocodile can smell a carcass hundreds of feet away. A civet cat hunts for insects. Leopards like Kamuti have the most varied diet of all the big cats in Africa, 
eating more than 30 different prey species. Kamuti will hunt animals as large as impala, down to those the size of a hare, or occasionally, even smaller. Almost anything is fair game. Though a fully grown hippo is a little out of her league. An Egyptian goose? Well, beggars can't be choosers. Timing is everything. Such an incredible hunt has never been filmed before. Watching again, it's clear just how close she got. At 13 years old, she's an elderly cat and not quite as fit as she once was. In her younger days, the outcome might have been different. She heads back out on the hunt. The Yinsefu pride is also looking for a kill. Together, they're a formidable team. And this time, the hippo must defend itself. <laughs> when in doubt, head back to the river. Hey, Love Nature fans, be sure to like and subscribe to catch all our wild animal stories. Get closer to nature right here on YouTube.